Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's me Shubhangi and you're watching Glam Mermaid. Welcome back to another exciting video and today's video will be very exciting because in this video I'll show you some sari styling ideas. So let's start. But before moving forward, if you haven't subscribed to my channel already, then do subscribe to my channel. It will mean a lot to me. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and comment down below which outfit was your favorite. And now without any further ado, let's get started. The first look is a pink jamdani sari look. I have paired it with a western blouse to give it a more bohemian and different look. And I have paired it with a contrasting green bangles. And for my makeup, I try to keep it in the pink tone. I have done a pink tone makeup with a pink lipstick. And I have twisted my hair and put a clip on the back. And I have put some flower ornaments to complement the look. And for jewelry, I have used some junk jewelries. For my earring, I have paired it with a silver oxidized earring. And I also wore a big oxidized finger ring. And for my neck piece, I went with a long pearl neck piece. And to finish off the look, I carried a golden clutch. And yeah, that's about this look. And this look turned out pretty cute and good. Let me know in the comment what you think about this look. And now let's move to the next look. For the next look, I wore a red pure silk sari and I have paired it with a yellow sleeveless blouse. And for the jewelries, I wore a choker neck piece with tassel. This kind of neck pieces are so trendy. Try one if you haven't already. For my hands, I wore four to five pieces of golden bangles and I tried to keep the look simple yet gorgeous. And for my makeup, I wore a red lips and some winged eyeliner. I didn't do much with my makeup. And then I uh, put on some red blush, that too with the help of the lipstick. Watch my other shorts video to know how I did that. And for my hair, I wore some flower jewelries again. This kind of flower ornaments looks so good. To know how I did this in detail, watch my short video. I have explained it in details. I'll give the link in the description box. So don't forget to check that out as well. You can wear this kind of neck piece with so many saris because it has multicolored tassels and they look so good. And yeah, that's basically about this look. You can recycle and use your mom sari in this way to look modern and classy. So that's about this look. I hope you like this look. And yeah, now let's move to the next look. For the next look, I have styled a blue handloom sari with a three-quarter sleeves tissue blouse having net sleeves. And for my jewelries, I wore a medium length neck piece with a locket. And for my earring, I wore a silver long earring. For my makeup, I did a blue contrasting eyes. And for my lipstick, I used a peachy pink lipstick. For the hairs, I did a messy low bun and I applied a flower, a red flower to it. This look was looking very sweet and elegant. And that's how I styled this look. Now let's move to the next look. For the next look, I have styled a yellow sari with a contrasting red blouse. And for this look, I kept my hair open and I used some yellow gajra to complement the look. And I carried this look with a red lips and a red bindi. The in-depth tutorial for this hairstyle is already up on my channel. I'll give the link in the description box. So don't forget to check that out as well. This look was so quick and easy but it looks so elegant. That was the last look and that's about the video. The outro video got deleted so I am ending the video here only. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. It will mean a lot to me and comment down below which look was your favorite. And we'll meet very very soon with another exciting video. Till then, stay happy. Bye.